It's a featherweight matchup between Dennis Seaver and the Cooler. The Cooler, coming off a great training camp. He's ready to put on a show. This guy has tremendous ground technique, and his ability to pass guard and get to a dominant position is elite. Dennis Seaver coming off a great training camp and feels out. This guy has world-class takedown defense. He is incredibly difficult to take down, and once you do get him down, he gets back to his feet very swiftly. Our tale of the take for this featherweight fight. Seaver is 19 years his elder. He will have a three-inch reach advantage. Once again, here's the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Holding a professional record of 11 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Manchester, England, the Cooler. Fighting out of the corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 23 wins, 14 losses. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Mannheim, Germany, Dennis Seaver! UFC crew mode, episode number 16. And today we've got a Russian guy. The, he's in the Russian Mafia. Just, I'm just going to put it out there. He is in the Russian Mafia. Uh, he is the former German kickboxer. If that makes any sense to anyone. Didn't really make any sense to me, really. I mean... I don't really watch UFC much anyway, but apparently he was a former German kickboxer champion, so, I mean, well done to him. I mean, as well, he's bloody 39, so he was an old, old dude, man. He's um, obviously 20 years older than me on this cream mode, so obviously he's tiring out a bit and he'll probably be soon retired. But anyway, this Siva guy is Russian. Uh, at, at first, when obviously it said about him being German, I was like, what the fuck? It says he's... He's Russian, but anyway, he's Russian and he was a former German champion. But anyway, we'll move on. He's actually uh, 10 centimetres smaller. His weight was the same as mine, but his reach was actually uh, 8 centimetres longer. So I'm quite surprised, really, because normally, you know, smaller guys don't really have the longest reach. But uh, obviously, this guy did. And to be fair, I quite regret picking him, to be fair, because, you know, he's 87 rated on this game and I'm only bloody 76. So obviously, kind of maybe could have been a complete battering you never know but you know we were trying to hold on he got me on the floor with a good punch there we uh you know strained him a bit there as well you know we we're knocking him knocking him kicking him we we're trying to get him down i mean this fight was going on a bit obviously halfway through the first round we were just trying to get him steady really and as you see there we make his head red uh i'm coming in with the kicks putting pressure on him he can't really block out his arms red his head's still red he's just standing there trying to block but um, I see in the end, I'm coming with all my kicks, all my moves, trying to knock him out, because that's what we want to do, knock him out, really. But it's just, it just won't happen in for now. But then, you know, we try and go on him, we keep going him, knock him down, we get on him, knock him out, and uh, we get another win. So, as you see there, a good fight, really. You know, he actually put up quite a good fight. So, I mean... Well done to him for, you know, doing that. But, uh, you know, you just, ca you just can't beat me. I'm unbeaten so far. I'm the best UFC fighter the lightweight division has ever seen. And Conor McGregor, I'm just going to say this now, I'm coming for your belt. I see there, good knockout from me. Look at that. Look at that kick. Just no chance onto the uh, gate at the back. A fence, sorry. And uh, I see we piled on top of him and just completely knocked him out. So another win for us. Another, you know, great fight. I actually liked fighting this guy. It was quite good. You know, he knocked me down once, nearly knocked me out. So, quite surprised, really. But, uh, as you see there, again, our faces aren't really, you know, really battered. It's just, you know, just, you know, normal, really. And as you see there, obviously, by official decision, we win. So, uh, great fight. But, anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the episode. If you have, please hit the like button. Subscribe if you are new. And, guys, I'll be seeing you later. Peace.